welcome to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Jazzy, and if you're a returning viewer, thanks for tuning in for today's video. In this video, I wanna share with you guys some products I've been obsessed with, so this will be my September favorites video, and I know it's been a while since I've come on my channel and done a video like this for you guys, but I had some products I have been obsessed with, so I thought this would be the perfect time to share them with you guys. So if this is something you're interested in, make sure you guys stay tuned for the video. Before I go ahead and jump right in, if you're not already subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button right down there. It would really warm my heart to have one more subscriber and while you're at it, go ahead and hit that notification bell so every time I upload a video, you won't miss out on any of my content. All right, without further ado, let's just go ahead and jump right into this video. So for this month of September, I did have some products I was absolutely obsessed with and I wanna share them with you guys. Now I do have a few beauty related products as well as some hair care products. So I'm just gonna go ahead and start off with the beauty products because I have more hair care related products. So the first product I was obsessed with is this Ole Henriksen Cold Plunge Pore Mask absolute favorite hands down if you guys are watching my videos then you all would know i have been loving this mask so 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 much i've already uploaded two videos on this mask the first video i did was showing you guys how i tackle my allergies and then the second video i did was my favorites video from old henriksen i share with you guys all of my favorite old henriksen products and this product actually made that video absolute favorite mask it gives my skin a really nice tingle sensation but it doesn't irritate my skin because as you guys know your girl does have some sensitive skin but it doesn't leave my skin feeling sensitive it doesn't leave my skin red now this is a clay mask and it performs very nicely when it dries it dries evenly and I love the fact when you rinse this mask off your skin has a nice youthful glow and it is so refreshing again it does leave my skin feeling tingly but it doesn't irritate my skin too much because if it did I wouldn't be able to bear it because I have really sensitive skin. The next product I want to share with you guys is something I use when I'm in the shower and I notice when I use this product it seems like I don't have to moisturize my skin once I get out of the shower even though I still typically do but I'm talking about this raw sugar sugar scrub. This is their exfoliate repair and replenish made from a natural sugar cane and a plant-based blend absolutely love 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 this scrub this has to be one of my absolute favorite scrubs that i've tried and i've tried a lot of scrubs i love to exfoliate my skin because i feel like once you exfoliate you can get rid of that top layer of dead skin and your skin just feels so soft who doesn't love soft skin you can find this mask at cvs or target i'm not too sure where else you can purchase this mask from because those are the only two stores i've seen it at i have this pineapple and Maui berry and coconut scent smells amazing it smells like hair grease but it's not overpowering and what I really really love about this mask is it does have a nice fine grade to it so it's not super abrasive once you apply it to the skin it really just melts right in and it leaves this really a nice rich moisturizing oil on your skin it's amazing and that's why when I get out of the shower after I use this product I don't necessarily feel like I need to moisturize because my skin is so hydrated it is is amazing the next product I want to share with you guys is something I discovered on Instagram and I discovered this product on Hollywood unlocked their page and I'm talking about this ancient cosmetics delicate rose and jojoba oil body butter smells amazing consistency love it it's vegan it's paraben free it has shea butter coconut oil cocoa butter jojoba oil and it is amazing you guys these products have no sulfates no parabens no gluten no dea no synthetic color and no animal testing it is super rich in consistency like a little goes a long way you guys it is so freaking thick i wish i could show you guys 
so thick and I love, love, love this product so much. And what I really like about Ancient Cosmetics, I browse their website. Their products are super affordable and they smell really good. Now I did try a few other products out from their collection, but out of the, all of the products that I tried out, this has been my absolute favorite. It smells really good, it gets the job done, it doesn't leave me feeling like greasy or too oily. And I feel like this would be a great moisturizer for the colder months coming up, so I wanted to go ahead and prepare myself. So I will have all of the product links that I mentioned in today's video down in the description box if you guys are interested. Make sure you guys check them out because their brand is amazing. Moving on to my hair care favorites, I wanna share something with you all that I've had for a while now, but I just didn't have any high expectations for this product. I only had it for my curly units, and as you guys can see, I do have a curly wig installed right now. So when I was playing around with this hair, I was thinking of styles to do, and I obviously chose for the wet look, and I wanted to go ahead and play around with this hair. Now this is like my third or fourth time using this product, and let me tell you guys, it has been amazing. The product I'm talking about is this Extreme from the Wet Line Professional. This is their styling gel. Absolutely love this product, you guys. I had no expectations on liking this product. I honestly purchased this a while ago, like maybe at the beginning of the year, just to have in my hair arsenal for my curly units. You guys know I love to do curly wigs. I love to do wigs in general. And I always like to have the products on deck, like conditioners, mousse, and gel, and things like that. So when I installed this unit and I needed some styles, I wanted to try different things out with the hair, I went ahead and played around with this gel and I noticed this gel doesn't flake up, it doesn't leave my hair feeling hard, it doesn't leave like a residue, which is amazing. It actually leaves my hair feeling very moisturized and it gives it this really nice wet look without it actually being wet, the hair is dry. So I didn't actually apply any of it to my hair today, but I did use it for my edges. It is amazing, it smells super good. I purchased mine off of Pharma Packs for 97 cents, you guys, yes, 97 cents. It smells amazing. It smells like how gel should smell. It is phenomenal. I think this is better than the Eco Styler. I think this is better than Gorilla Snot. Honestly, I love this gel so much because you can use it on your hair, but you can also use it on your edges as well. And as you guys know, some edge controls you can't be used on your hair, and some gels can't be used on your edges because they do leave a residue. But with this product, I find that it's not the case. It's very versatile. You can use it either way you like. And I've actually tried this on my real hair as well. And as you guys know, I did get a relaxer like two or three months ago, but my hair did not take to the relaxer, so my hair is very coarse and it's very thick. It's almost like it's transitioning and this product laid my hair down. My hair looks so cute. I actually did like a sleek ponytail using this product, which I wanna do a video using this on like a ponytail for you guys. So if you all are interested in seeing a tutorial on how to do like a sleek bun or a sleek ponytail, let me know down in the comment section below because I would love to film a video for you guys using this product because it is amazing. I haven't had a bad experience with this gel and honestly you guys I wasn't even expecting it to be this good so I think that's what has my mind like so blown is that it performs amazing and I had it this entire time and I never used it the next product I want to share with you guys is something I picked up from Target out of their little travel section. If you guys didn't know, Target has this buy three, get one free on their travel section. I believe it's for like hair care products. And while I was just shopping, I noticed that they have this Nexus Comb Through Touchable Hold Finishing Mist. This is like a hairspray absolute favorite hairspray. I love myself a good hairspray and I try different hairsprays. I think currently I have like around four or five hairsprays that I use actively, but this has been my go-to. I've been reaching for this a lot. It is so easy to work with, it's so easy to use. It gives my hair the hold without actually like leaving my hair feeling crunchy or leaving like a white residue because some hairsprays do cast a residue and some hairsprays are super duper firm. They leave your hair feeling super stiff, but with this product, even once I spray it on my hair, if I still have to go through my hair with a brush or any type of repasses with a styling tool, I know 
notice it doesn't leave my hair crunchy or flaky. So that's always something to keep in mind when you're using a hairspray. And I know some people do get detoured from hairsprays because they can seem a little intimidating if you're not using the right one. But for me, this is amazing. I also have fine hair. So with this being a lightweight type of finishing spray, it works really, really well for my hair. So I did wanna go ahead and share that with you guys. The next product I wanna share with you guys is the tool that I use in my hair care routine. And I feel like these tools are amazing. So I wanna share them with you guys because sometimes we can find ourselves using the same tools on our hair and they can be damaging to our hair. So I wanna give you guys a good alternative that's affordable and it's effective. They work really, really well. Plus they're stylish. The product I'm talking about is this Care Co Tangle Buster Brush. If you guys are familiar with my channel, then you guys would have seen the video I shared with you all on how I use these brushes in my hair care routine. Absolutely love, love, love these tools. I'm really obsessed with this brush in particular because it reminds me of the cross between my It's a 10 brush with the bristles, but it also reminds me of the Demon brush. It is amazing. And as you guys can see, it has like these little vents in the back, which allows heat to get through it. So it's a good brush for blow drying. It's really ideal for blow drying, but it also detangles at the same time. And what I really like about Careco brushes is you can use them on all hair types. Types. They're really good for detangling hair, especially children's hair. They're really gentle. So I will recommend you guys check them out. I will have their website down in the description box. And I'll go ahead and leave that video in the card section right here so you guys can see how I use these tools in my routine. And this way you guys will be able to incorporate them into okay. yours. The last two products I wanna share with you guys are kind of similar, but they're very different in their own ways. And I'll share with you guys what I'm talking about in a second. But the products that I'm talking about are scrunchies. And if you guys have not noticed here lately, I have been obsessed with hair scrunchies, they are amazing. I don't know what took me so long to jump on the scrunchie bandwagon, but your girl was late and now I'm loving it. So I went ahead and I picked up some satin hair scrunchies off of Amazon and these are the satin ones. And they're really good. I like the fact that you do get more bang for your buck. They're kind of stretchy, but what I really picked them up for was when I'm doing like protective hairstyles. So I am getting closer to getting my Japanese thermal straightening treatment. I am gonna start doing a more air drying and I wanna do more air dried styles. So I was thinking something like Bantu knots. So I figured instead of me using like a regular rubber band or regular elastic bands, I would use some satin hair scrunchies because they would protect my hair and they really do protect my hair. The only thing that I don't like about these scrunchies is the fact that the band inside is kind of tight and it does pull my hair and make my scalp feel really tender and I notice when I'm using these silk scrunchies I can't wear them for too long so the last product I want to share with you all is another scrunchie and I actually picked this up from Claire's they have a really good sale you can get three of them for $15 which I know doesn't sound like a good bang for your buck but in my opinion it's worth it because these scrunchies are super duper stretchy they have a very nice elastic band in the inside opposed to the silk ones where they're super Super tight and they give me a headache these are so comfortable I find that my hair is still relaxed and my scalp is able to breathe and flourish so that pretty much wraps up this video you guys I hope you all enjoyed it I will have all the links for each product I mentioned in today's video down in the description box below so make sure you guys check that out if you guys are interested in any of the products I mentioned in today's video and I'll catch you guys in my next one for the stars